Welcome back. In our last video, we started creating some groups. We explored one style of structuring groups following a recommendation of our KNX national groups. As this way may not be the most comprehensive one, you can browse the web for various group address generators. You can find some examples in the description below. With several hundred groups in the end, you will agree that a sensible structure is key in maintaining an overview. So let's dive right in. We are in the first tab, the Buildings panel, and we just changed it to Groups. Here are our groups. Let's go ahead and delete them all. Instead, we will import the groups generated by a web tool. Voila! Now we have 393 groups imported. This is the structure trades as first level. And here, for light switching, the different groups across the floors and rooms. This search folder illustrates what is left to do. In middle group 5.1, we have groups for measured temperatures. The next step now is to link groups to objects. First option is via a panel showing devices, such as the buildings panel. Second option is via the groups in the sidebar. That was it for today. Next time we will look at building functions. Thanks for watching. As always, you can find the link to the exported project in the description below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel to stay tuned for upcoming videos.